Hi, my name is Stephanie Aspen. I am the founder and managing director of The Career Company, a recruitment agency for creative talent. I started off um, at uh, the Foundation TV, uh, working on kids TV shows like Fingertips and then on to Ministry of Mayhem. And then I moved to London and started working for Cactus TV, working on the Richard and Judy show. And it was there that I spotted a uh, real gap in the market for a uh, talent agency that could span right the way from pre-production through to post. Um, worked my absolute socks off, uh, went and got, a, went, went and wrote a business plan, took it to Barclays Bank and uh, they gave me a business account with an overdraft of I think £200 at the time. And that was back in 2005 and uh, just growing the business, working very, very long hours until um, to where we are today, which is the UK's largest talent agency. Very early start, coffee, laughing, meetings, very late finish. Uh -oh. Good fun. Um, happiness, um, responsibility and pride. I actually can't pinpoint a specifically funniest or specifically favourite moment. Um, the last, I suppose, two years has been my favourite moment in time. I've got a really, really strong and funny team um, behind me and working with me. So every day there is there is laughs, there is favourite moments, it's just kind of this this ongoing um, kind of laughs whilst we're working, so. 100% um, building long-term relationships. Um, number two would be uh, honesty, and number three would be hard work. If, I'm, if I made a mistake, um, to put my hand up first. Um, I, over the years, I've, I've, one of the things that I've learned is, put your hand up first, I've made the mistake, just, is just much better overall than trying to scrub around and, and make out that it wasn't you, because it's just, the truth will always come to light. To get the absolute basics right first, um, we have thousands of CVs that come into ours, and it's some really simple things that mean that they don't, that you know, that they do get overlooked, um, and they don't go to the next stage. And then it's obvious stuff. It's the it's spelling mistakes on the CV. It's sending a covering letter addressed to the wrong person, or um, you know, applying to be a producer but saying your lifelong dream is not to be a producer or to be a camera operator or whatever it might be just really think about every single application you send in don't just you know quickly send out 20 because it's a numbers game if you send out four really great ones you'll get noticed be presentable um, but do your research on the company that you are going to meet um, they will ask you questions on the type of work that they have done on on the other clients that that they work with or perhaps other companies within the umbrella make sure you do research on those companies and just show that you are making the effort for this um for this interview and, and that you really do want the job um and then when they ask you to ask you know have you got any questions for me that they may say don't turn around and say um do i get an hour for lunch or um, am I working Monday to Friday? Because they are not the questions that an employer wants to hear. An employer wants to hear really well thought out questions about the, the role. Work your absolute socks off as, as much as you can, you know, politically correct or not, if you're supposed to do nine till six, initially do 8.30 till 6.30, show that you would do anything for the job and that you'll, you, you will work and, and prove yourself to, to your employer that that's where you want to be. And, and an employer, a good employer, will invest time in people that will invest their time in the business. 
Last word of advice from a um, business point of view is um, what goes around comes around. Um, and if you run an honest business and you work hard, you will 100% succeed. It may take slightly longer um, building the foundations, but once you're at the top, you will be a, a really strong um, um, company with, with great foundations rather than, than a company that's just climbed the ladder to get to the top.